at least two or three a day. Troy Montague's job takes him all over the city on both sides of the state line. Yeah, I've taken a few pictures of him. Troy is talking about these guys' expired temporary tags, and when he posted a couple of them on social media... It, it kind of blew up on Facebook. No doubt. The Missouri Highway Patrol agrees it's a huge problem. You need to get out and register your vehicle. Sergeant Lowe says in 2020, the state offering up a 60-day grace period on temporary tags due to the pandemic, but that expired two years ago this month. It was taken advantage of, obviously, but I've seen temp tags that are expired from 2017. The Missouri Highway Patrol says since that grace period ended, they've continued to pull over drivers and pass out tickets, but now there's so many out there. And something's rolling down the road and, and they haven't had it titled for a year or six months. That is irresponsible. Troopers say a lot of the issues with temp tags are the states that they're registered in. States like Kansas give you 60 days to pay your sales tax. Over in Missouri, it's just 30 days. Times are tough for some folks and we want to take that into account, but you have to take care of your responsibilities and part of that responsibility of owning a vehicle is registering it. The Highway Patrol adds you can't do anything with your vehicle until you do. Just adding to that financial burden that you already have with buying the vehicle. In Kansas City, Alan Chilp, KBC 9 News. The Highway Patrol says those late fees and court costs can be as high as several hundred dollars when you register the car and if you get a ticket, it could double the expense.